Amen. Amen. That's my little bit. This, this man is so disconnected. Like you said, my listen, you need to get together. One day at a time, but it is possible. It is possible, and I believe it's possible. But we're not going to do it unless everybody's involved. Amen. 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 All right. Get to my little thing. I wrote for my sister. Because she's my sister. She's your sister. She's your sister. She's your grandmother. She's your mother. She's your grandmother. She's your mother. She was Sister Lena. Lena Bina, I named her name. <laughs> Lena Bina. And my, the name of my poem is My Sister. Melina, Melina, Melina. Lena Bina. Well, that's a nickname I gave her. I mean, uh, she was my sister, my friend, my confidant, and more. <laughs> Not only did she inspire me, she also acted like she was my mama and even spanked me. <laughs> she made me wash the dishes, mop the floor, sweep the kitchen, even run my tail to the store. That spanking with that belt, ooh, that sure left a sore well. I was about five or six as I stand here and think. One morning while Lena was cutting up chicken, up in the kitchen <laughs> I said to her, that knife ain't sharp. She said, you want to see? She grabbed my arm so quick, slid it once, and I fell to my knee. I screamed, I'm going to tell daddy, I'm going to tell daddy, I'm going to tell daddy what you did to me. Her face lit up with fear and her eyes watered too. She couldn't believe that the knife had drew blood. She didn't want no beating from daddy if he knew. You grab, you twist it, and cut my little tiny arm. Mm -hmm. And now you're filled with sorry, so you won't be hurt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you cut me with a knife, a deep cut indeed. And you know what? That really sucked. I could have bled to death. <laughs> <laughs> she begged me all day long not to tell daddy what she had did. Because she knew with that news, daddy would have blew his lid. <laughs> but don't you worry, sis. I never told daddy. <laughs> I never told daddy because I loved you too much. Amen. I spared you from a whooping, the whooping of your life. <laughs> you know to this day, I still have to start to prove it. That start my right arm from that really sharp knife. <laughs> As my sister's body lay here before us, a question weighs on my mind. Oh God, oh God, why did you take my sister so so? Why did you heal her this time? <laughs> he said in so soft in a voice that was so clear. My dear, my dear, my dear, she'll always be there. Her job there was complete. I needed her to come home. Yes, ma'am. No more standing out in the rain. No more doors slamming in her face. No more asking, why don't you let me in? Because that's really how the story began. Don't you worry, my child. She's not alone. He who hears let him hear. She has her white robe on and sing it in the choir, which she loves to do, sing anywhere and any attire. She's about to receive her crown as promised as a good and faithful servant who kept the faith she endured till the end. She fought a good fight. She fought a good fight. She tried with all her might. She knocked on the door and you didn't let her in. She tried. She was human. We made mistakes. I said I was sorry. Okay. Okay. How many times I got to say I was sorry? Until I'm here. And you still don't get it. I'm sorry. 
was too late. You lost the opportunity to say you were sorry. Hallelujah. No more tears. No more pain. No more looking at the little angry faces. She reached the finish line at the end of her race. Mm. Don't you worry, my child. Don't you worry none. She's right over there, right beside my side. Just keep the faith and do my will. And one day, you receive yours too, my God. And this is just a message to all of you who share good times and bad times in Lena's life. You, who shared good times. You, who shared bad times. You, who have talked with her. You, you have walked with her. You, who have laughed with her too. You, who have cried with her. You, who have fought with her to get your way. Oh yeah, you. <laughs> you, who have helped her. And you, who have cared for her. And you, who have played with her too. You, who have stayed with her. You, who have prayed with her. And you, who have helped her get through. You, who have thought about her. Even though you didn't live with her, she knew you loved her too. Lena, my sister, will never die. <laughs> that shell that she wants to have down there must go back to the earth from which it comes. <laughs> that the memories, our memories of my sister will live on forever in each and every one of us who shared and cared and helped her go through. That means you, 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 and even you. So come on, family, friends. No more long faces. This is a gone away celebration. Come on and help celebrate her by sharing a memory or two. I can't wait to hear him. I am Lena's little sister. Amen. And this is your invitation. Amen. Amen.